What's going on, everybody? It's Boss with the Most Lit. What's up, shit girl? DJ Excel. And this, this is, is the, the No, no homo, homo Show. Where we talk about all things. Homo. Homo is fuck. Gay, 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 gay. We killed that. We killed that. We yeah, learned. We, gotta, we, learned. we, we still do. We still do. We, we going to get it together. All right. All right. How you doing today? What's good? Yo, I'm doing good. I put that um, shit on for y'all today. Okay, bitch. <laughs> so, nah, now you just, feel like yourself. The hat and the shirt. I put that shit. You <laughs> you wanted somebody to compliment you this whole time. Yeah, y'all rate, rate my fit in the comments. Oh my god. One to twenty. Fuck you talking about. I'm, I'm well, this time. was a sponsored shirt. Shout out to sp- um the villain. The villain from Canada, Collection. right? Collection. Yeah, from Canada. They sent us this on the progress report. So shout out to my team, the progress report. Shout out to y'all, the villain from Canada. Yeah, I, I fuck with it. I, I should have worn mine too. I ain't nobody's matching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we not. We not. <laughs> we actually not. Actually. Okay. Um. <laughs> so, uh, before we get started into like what we want to talk about, I got I seen this situation happen online, right? And I wanted to get your input on it. Okay. And it was a dude and a girl, but this is just a general situation that, you know, we all can relate to. And the funny thing is, our um, little production manager, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to say little, you know what I'm saying? Big production. Uh, Big yeah. He was saying, I, I was telling him, like, damn, bro, like, um, you probably tired of listening to this gay shit, right? <laughs> <laughs> and he said, he said, no, what I'm realizing is we all got the same motherfucking problems. <laughs> <laughs> That's fact. And we sure do, right? So same problems different gender. Right. So um this this situation relates to all of us, right? All right. You might have seen it too, it kinda of went viral, right? So um Uh-oh. it was a dude driving a girl, right? And driving her to the airport. And he was like, Yo, you you getting dropped the fuck off. And she like, Man, you lame, you lame. And he's like, Nah, I flew you out and you ain't trying to give me no pussy. Like, Ooh. you can go back. You can go. Damn. And she like, Nigga, you lame. Like, you going, you going to drop me back off at the airport because I ain't had no sex with you. And then he was like, He was like, Yeah, like you walking around my house, like just in your towel and shit. You knew I flew you out here. If I'm flying you out here, we fucking. All right, Ooh. and literally dropped her off at the airport, and then, <laughs> and then I, I was thinking like, damn, the dude, were, like, at least he dropping her off, you know? <laughs> Not saying that, but like, but the way he was talking, I was like, yeah, well, yeah, at yeah. least this petty nigga is at least dropping her <laughs> off, right? And then she was like, yeah, well, bye. And he was like, yeah, well, you gotta get a um a ticket. And she was like, what? He was like, yeah, I canceled, I canceled your spirit ticket. First of all, you were saying all that, and you flew her on spirit. Okay, so let's dissect that. But the biggest why the, you cancel the ticket? But why would you say I flew you out and nigga the whole time you flew her out on spirit? That's not a flex. That's not a flex. <laughs> First of all, I just want to start by saying men are weird. All right, I think men yeah. are weird. All right, that uh, is that is some egotistical shit. Like if you think just because if you think is there's no reason for you to feel like a uh, woman owe you sex like there is I don't care if you just bought her a Benz I don't care if you just gay I don't care what you did there's mm-hmm. nothing that I feel like to equivalent to a woman being like you know what did you deserve this I mean on her own time like if she like you deserve it on her own time but it's like if the niggas like all right now where's my sex I'm gonna be like, nigga, what? Like, that's corny. That and is. And I would weird. never do that to no girl. I did it about some food, though. <laughs> like, they ain't gonna cook for me. I do it about some food in a heartbeat. Bitch, look. When I cleaned up the house, I did the dishes, you ain't gonna cook. I do shit like that, but it's, I ain't never gonna be like, you ain't gonna fuck me. It's the fact of how mad you are, you bro. You took the motherfucker to the airport, canceled you, their ticket. What you do is, you fly a girl out, all right? Let's say you had an expectation of fucking y'all ain't fuck. You gonna be like, bro. You yeah. gonna go back to your home like, bro, we ain't even fuck. Like, <laughs> right. I ain't doing that shit again. You not about to be like, so we not fucking? Right. Pack your shit. I mean, the young me, though. No, that look thirsty. The you young looking me, I creepy. might have did that on some young shit. But, like, yeah, that's, that's corny, bro. Listen. Like, if I'm flying you out, if I wasn't married, and I flew you out, <laughs> I got to say this every <laughs> show, right? I, I flew you out, and we having a good time. First of all, first thing f- to me yeah. like, is we vibing. Like, if we if we on, like, a little vacation, like, first of all, we need to be vibing, all right? And you ain't want to say, I wouldn't really get that mad. I wouldn't get mad. I wouldn't, like... What I would get mad about is if I flew you out and your sex was whack. <laughs> Did, didn't you? No. You, oh, that wasn't me. No, no, no. I remember oh, one I time. I, no, up. no. One, 
a bitch flew in and you was flew like, in. man, I was too tired all weekend. <laughs> oh, yeah, she, she was mad, mad at me. She was she mad at me. She about to return your ass. Yeah, no, for real. Wow, yeah, she was mad. This girl flew in to see me and I ain't had sex with her. I was tired, though. Yo. Ooh, that was this, a whole, ooh. PTSD. When I took her to the airport, she ain't say nothing to me. Like, she ain't even want to give me no hug. Bitch, she flew in for the D. She did what the nigga did kind of to me. Damn, I'm a victim. <laughs> That's fucked up. You see she how we be re reminding of each other about yeah, trauma? That's crazy. We be trying to forget about our trauma. She love bow out me. Wow, that's crazy. So should wow. I have gave her some sex? Cause she flew oh. in from me. Was I obligated to? See, that's the thing. Like it would have been nice. Of course, somebody if you Little flying bonus, it, right? yeah, like. But like, bitch, you see me working every single day. Like, rub my back. I forgot about that. That's the same situation. That is. All right, so y'all gotta leave this comment. Is <laughs> like funny. if you fly somebody out, are you expecting that sex? And how? What's the level of mad? Of course you're gonna be like, <laughs> damn, I thought you know what I'm saying. But I would not even say that to girl. I might think that in my head, like, damn, I'm not gonna like. So we not fucking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm that kind of nigga that will just say some little petty shit like, damn. So when you gonna, <laughs> you ain't gonna got down, got down. <laughs> Like, I'm going to try to hint, hint, wink, wink, you know what I'm saying, a little bit, but I ain't going to get it. I think yeah, he was trying, I think he was probably rubbing this shit up on her back. Yo. <laughs> she probably was scooting at the end of the bed. Bruh, men are so different. Like, yeah, they are. They are. Um, he was bad, mad. He was pissed. He was in Atlanta? Bitch, I don't know. Oh, I'm just I, trying to. I, I couldn't see the I'm airport. He was going district. so fast. <laughs> I was trying to see how far he drove to the airport. No, I'm and trying then, to dissect it. You know what? It. He was just a whole bitch ass dude anyway, because he's recording the whole argument. Oh yeah, he was trying and to go she's viral. She's like, bro, and, and she kind of kept it player. She's like, bro, like get that phone on my face. Like you a lame for that. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, I feel bad for y'all ladies. Man, y'all yeah. gotta do better. Yeah. Because that's not cute. Yeah, and don't brag about flying somebody out when it's on spirit. Yeah, if it's spirit frontier. You just, can't. just be humble with that. You can't. One. If it's Jet Blue, you might <laughs> can get away with a Jet Blue. What, what, what show do you fly in on uh, when she came to see you? Man. <laughs> she was a she Delta. She was like, I'm getting ready for that ass. <laughs> Knowing her, though, I ain't going to lie. It pro Man, I don't know. It's a hit or miss. <laughs> like, because sometimes flight, the price don't make sense. Bitch, if y'all see me on Spirit, <laughs> just know anything else was $200 more and I. <laughs> I ain't broke, but I ain't dumb. Hey, I ain't, no cap. Look, like, sometimes the price is just... If my book bag really fat, mind your fucking business, because you know we can't have nothing else. Y'all know we can't have hey, nothing else, yeah, all right? if it's just like a quick little trip, it's giving Frontier Spirit, but if Listen. it's giving vacation, I ain't doing no vacation. <laughs> you can't start your vacation like that, because you're going to be irritated the whole time. Your flight going to be delayed. You ain't got no drinks on the plane. It's going to be, unless you know how to pick your own drinks on the plane. <laughs> you already know. <laughs> you already know. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Yeah, well, today we're going to talk about the friend zone, okay, and normalizing seeing a film and a stud and not assuming that they are a couple, but mm -hmm. just seeing them and being like, okay, they're friends. But then we're going to talk about some other situations because at the same time, it's just it gets real tricky with this one, okay? Mm -hmm. It gets real tricky because, all right, so f for you, every friend of yours, do you have any film friends? Actually, I don't got no fucking friends. Are right, you got film friends? Kia. Okay. All right, do you have gay femme friends? Well, Kia was she dabbled in girls, but um, yeah, I I have yeah, like there's okay. there's people that like I y'all I don't really call that many people my friends, but there's a lot of girls that I'm cool no with friends. that I never looked at like that and are feminine and and pretty. And I, just I need them. somebody with more friends because they still don't got no friends. <laughs> no, I'm but I, the, the people that are my friends are solid. I just <laughs> oh, she's so sweet, solid. <laughs> Y'all solid. Oh, um, weak. But I was gonna ask basically. Well, I don't know if this really pertains just ask to you. Me. Damn, I got friends, bro. Bro, she no friends. She can't relate to this question. All right, so basically, a femme friend. Hey, let's just be clear. I don't okay. got no friends by choice. Not cause like I'm a shady motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, no. I'm she's just, just she's, a real a, she's introvert. an introvert, like a motherfucker, yeah. like for right, real, for right. real. So your friends that are femme friends, did y'all start off as friends or was it like y'all was talking at first and then y'all became friends? You know what? There's a, there's a few people out here that like later on told me like, you know, I was trying, like, you know, I liked mm. you and it was awkward and it was like, first of all, that would never have been a <laughs> <Right>. thing, <laughs> but, um, I'm fucking yeah, weak. because you know what? Sometimes, like, especially like on some DJ shit, you be just cool, ready to have a good time with people. Yeah, lit. 
Yeah. And they might. They be have a different agenda. Yeah. <laughs> they trying to get in them pants. Hey, girl, I got you a shot because I was drinking a shot and I get them for free. Bruh. You thought I bought you a shot? Bruh. Like, damn, I can't just buy you a drink without me trying to, like, you think it's flirting? I feel like everything that a stud do to a film is considered a flirt. It's if like you, a man, if though. If you smile, if yeah, a man, that's kind of true. I mean? If you smile at her, if you hold the door open, if you say you look good, you can't even compliment a girl nowadays without being like, damn, but I'm just saying it as a friend, you know, I don't want you to but like flirting with you. I don't know, me, just us just being women, like, I could have a femme friend. And, like, if you was walking around the house topless, like, I seen titties, it's not like, oh, my God, that's turning me yeah. on. Unless I actually <laughs> look at you attractive, you know. Right, right. Like, then it can get a little yeah. weird. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I would say for the most part, let me think about my friends. Yeah, because if you know you toxic. It's a hit or miss. All right, nah, for real. So you have people that you really just looked at as a friend. and From the out. beginning? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yo, bro, you the most toxic. Yo, I'm realizing how toxic. I'm trying to be honest. No, we have to be honest every show. All right, this is what I'm gonna say. All right, this is what I will say. A lot of my film friends wasn't people that I wanted to talk to, but they may have tried to talk to me, and I had the friends on them. I definitely seen you friend zone. Some I had to be clear, like especially once I hit you with the sis, it ain't no coming back out of the sis. Once I sis you. I would never date you ever. Once I friends on you too, I would never date you. You know what I'm saying? I got a question yeah. real quick, and this is from my boy. I ain't gonna say no names, but uh -oh. a very close friend of mine. I know and we this. had to, all right, because I don't got three <laughs> friends. Yeah, yeah. Right. Damn, I need more friends. I'm fucking weak. I'm about to just start texting people like, <laughs> "Hey, wanna hang out? Yeah. You gonna stare them up? Yeah. She ain't gonna text back to next week. Look. Oh shit, I just got caught up. Um, Yo, how's next month? I, so, all right, just real quick. Yeah. So. He's kicking with this girl, right, that, like, he kind of like, but she just got out of a relationship, so he don't want to make it awkward or nothing. Yeah. But she keep saying, thank you, friend. Ooh. And he's asking, he, he, all right, so her birthday about to come up, right? Yeah. And he's like, yo, I wanted to get her, like, this person. I'm like, no, bro, like, don't do all that. But yeah. anyway, like, <laughs> he it's the friend is throwing him off. Could it be flirting or like did she friends on him? Uh, from my experience, when a girl keeps saying friend, that mean they are trying to friends on you. So like, even if she like come to your down. crib after the club just to kick it, y'all drinking, throwing some shots, not not nothing sexual. Should but, he try some shit? Nah, oh. <laughs> it, it, it wasn't nothing sexual, but it kind of like weird because like, hey, you just came to the crib, drank after the club, so you just drove home at four a.m. Not saying we cuddled up or nothing but we just did a little we drank some beers talked but we should normalize that like why can't we come over late night and take shots okay on some platonic shit and just like have a conversation like just because i come over late night i mean i'm trying to fuck like but could that be misleading though it can definitely be misleading if you because let's say you like you a girl and she's coming head. if you like a girl a mm. pretty girl and like you turn she turn then y'all Go to your house after y'all drink. Y'all having a great time enjoying each other's company. I think it's only misleading when you like that person because they probably really in their heads like that's my nigga, like that's like my bro. And then you like nah, but she be like smiling at me, and sometimes she grab my shoulder. Like I have friends <laughs> who are touchy, but they don't be meaning nothing. Like so, if somebody, all right, so we that's, that's, we clearing it up. If somebody be like friend, they they not if they hit you with that all oh, friend friend this friends that mm, that's friend zone that's okay that's that friend zone flag. And what I told him is because I do bruh. that sis. I hit him with <laughs> damn. The if I, if I the like sis. somebody, they say something. Oh, hard, sis, you like. funny. You look good today. Thank you, sis. You too. Wow, that's, very that's like clear. church lady. Like. Let's be sis. Let's be very okay. Cause I don't, I'm not a friend. I never said the word friend. Like I'm not a hey yeah. friend. I've never been that person. Yeah, I'm like a sis. Yeah, or my so, nigga. Yeah, <laughs> not not. I hit you with my nigga. It's like you might be ugly. Say I'm like you snore. What up, my dog? Like, like <laughs> your voice deeper. So nah, for like. real. But I would okay. I would say like. Yeah, for most of the people that, I, that are my fan friends, like they they probably did have a crush on me. But I would like to say to some, you know, films like, is it a is it a gay thing? Because like, it's like, all right, if you like girls, I like girls. I gotta be into you. Why is it not like let's be friends? Why is it all like let let's talk? Like why is it always that first one? Why is it not like let's let's just be friends? Yeah, 
that's tough, right? Yeah, because sometimes people like fall in love with your personality or like mm-hmm. when you so fun and you don't you're not stressing shit, like people love that shit. Cuz it be make around you look at, it make you look at all your friends like damn, is all my friends somebody who once had a crush on me? This motherfucker. Even my boyfriends be like they, they <laughs> we used to talk, friend. we used to talk back. I really don't have too many friends where we didn't start like as like because you a hoe <laughs> i'm weak because i can't say that no but it, it don't mean that i like them back but like i will say like it's a big percentage of like the people that are my friends whether it's a man or a woman like it probably started because one of us liked each other i did really good at drawing that line from since i went to boarding school in ninth grade like i lived with 12 girls so it was like bitch i'm living with you i'm gonna see you looking crazy i'm gonna see you crying and stuff yeah. we not going to like each other yeah. all right i'm looking at you like my fucking sister because bitch you <laughs> annoying when i'm you know how you like be around somebody all the time yes, like they start getting on yeah. nerves they have so, in relationships <laughs> say no play. Yeah, no it, it could <laughs> you know what i'm saying but um okay so all your so now I'm looking at all your friends. I'm look, I'm going down. The yeah. Line. All right. And I said it to say, all right. So when you start dating somebody, okay, and they got stud friends, okay, are you thinking like, damn, did that bitch used to like you? Do she still like you? Yo, I can, I, I could be honest. So like, I feel like some stud friends give off a energy that they liked her because there there's been people that gave off that energy and then there've been people that's like that are my my girl actually she got a lot of stuff friends look at Uh-oh. me zoom in nah, nah but like <laughs> a lot of them i never got that energy and what up you yeah. know what i'm saying and they're, they're, like yo it was it was crazy um when i first started talking to her right uh probably talking to her for like three months right because we was having sex and shit right? but but we did actually take our time for that all right but it was crazy because she was like this is you know where it's like a fun period where like you're not mm. in love with them well i would like yeah, yeah no maybe three months i was maybe it was two months or something oh, you know but anyway such a nah, not saying it like that but just try to get a time line where like you know it's too early to take shit personal right right okay all right okay, so that's okay, what i'm okay. trying to do all right so she's like, yeah, my friend's about to come in, visit me. Mm-hmm. You know, we had so much fun last time, right? So I'm like, dope. Uh, let's go to Magic City because there was a day party. Shout you know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know if you was out there. I know Lala was out there. I don't know. Let's go to Magic City. Why y'all didn't invite me? Look, this motherfucker. All right. So anyway, I think it was a coalition joint or whatever. Oh, okay, cool. But anyway, so I'm like, this going to be lit. Your friend is stud or whatever, but she gonna be hyped to come to Magic City, and yeah. after that we'll do this. So like her friend come, energy weird. All right. Ooh. So so um, what, what you mean by weird? Like what what what's some just signs? like standoffish. Okay. Okay. And the thing is, I'm not a real like oh now you my dog too. Yeah, no, like yeah, I'm yeah. cool, but like gotta you, fill you out. Yeah. So I'm a, I'm gonna give you an example, right? So mm. we at Magic City, so we all sitting there. The friends sit in the back like and on like a couch and yeah. like lay up like put the legs up on the couch like she bored oh. bitch you at magic fucking city nah, you look lame right now things. you you just came in town you right you looking like you ready to go <laughs> all right so then we go somewhere else and she just acting weird like we all getting lit and she just like acting weird right <laughs> and the thing is i'm a real energy person like yeah. i i feel that shit right so then um so then we go our separate ways because the girl wanted to go back to the house. Like, bitch, you just came, came out of in, town. How you, know you come to Atlanta want to go in the house, exactly, bro? Exactly, right? Come so on. Then, so then I was, I think I was DJing when I was done. I was kind of lit, and I hit up I hit up my girl. was like, I'm trying to come over. What's hey. up, right? So if, if you come visit your friend, your friend, she, my girl going to be in her room. Yeah. You going to be in the living room. You going to put the TV up or something, right? No, the girl was like, oh, well, I'm going to go get a hotel then. She was salty. She was salty. As I ain't salt. used salty in long in a long time. But she was salty, right? <laughs> so like, so like, it was just, and this was so long. When you ago. call him like a salty. That's like the <laughs> top tier. This was tier, this like. was so long ago. But I had to tell my girl. I was like, I don't even know if we was in a relationship yet. Yeah. So I had to tell her like, yo, whatever, whatever. But you know that girl like you, right? And yeah. my girl was so in denial, and I'm like, yeah. Are you really in denial? <laughs> but she. She had to be because she gave me 
she kicked it with me. She ain't my yeah. girl ain't act funny to me. Yeah, yeah. So like, you ain't know this girl liked you. I think once you put motherfuckers in the friend zone, you don't be looking at them like that. Like you don't. And they, she might have flew in thinking she flew in. Oh, like, she flew in. Thought she was about to get in. Did she know that y'all was talking? Did she know? Yeah, she had- I'm. Pr- oh, okay, yeah, okay. like. <laughs> the way my girl like and that's the one thing my girl ain't never front on me she ain't never treat me weird Period. around the girl Real ass so that's bitch. why i had to be Something i had to just be like be. cool like I, I kept thinking like i'm not because you gotta check yourself too on some stuff you, do. Shit. you, you do. gotta check yourself like am i tripping am i just being yes. jealous because it's all right we get jealous sometimes it's okay the girls get jealous too you gotta be real with yourself right so i sat back i'm like yo am i tripping and i'm like Bro, I'm not tripping. Yeah. I'll be asking you sometimes, like, bro, is this, does this oh, you're like, seem nah, right? Nigga, that's a little, yeah. that's a little too close yeah. to home right there. Yeah, so, like, I had to, I asked my sister, I'm like, bro, I'm not tripping. And then my sister came around, like, the last day, and the girl was acting weird. My sister's like, yeah, bro, she, she like her. I'm like, so sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, like you said, like, when you like somebody, you see it a certain way, and they don't even see it that way. For real, because I done had some friends where I done had a crush on them, and they was like, they were like, I never knew. I was like, bitch, I used to do every. I used was fucking. I cleaned Flowers. your toilet. Like I wrote you a love note. What you mean you never knew? I thought you been sisterly love. No, bitch. I'm trying to fuck. Like what are you talking about? Like so, girl. Uh oh, not the ring. Everybody got that ring. All right. Um. So so how do you feel about like yeah. your girl having stuff? For like, me, man, it gets you gotta you gotta have a certain level of security within yourself and trust facts. between you and your girl. But it gets real, like, you get curious at times, you know, because I know how I would, you know, fuck, like, my my girl look good as fuck. So, I would, if I was any other stuff, I would try to holler at her. It's hard to think, like, you just all right with being friends. <laughs> right? right? Like, yeah, you, I ain't gonna you lie. know I ain't if gonna she lie. was single that you would be trying to talk. That's how I be thinking. But no. then I'll be like, I can't do that. I ain't gonna lie. I, I can't think no, that. No, I do be thinking, like, but if... If you had a chance, you yeah, would take it. Because you would be dumb not to. That's how I feel like. Like That's a she, fact. This girl's bad and she's smart. She this, she that. And you her friend, so I know you know this thing about her. So you should know, like, damn, she is, like, wife material. So I'll be like, yo, that's kind of tricky. But where, yeah. what gets me fucked up is, like, all right, do I ask? Did they used to talk? You know what? Like, how'd y'all meet? You like, are what? you trying to avoid that or be like, how'd y'all meet? Tell me all about your friend. I think you <laughs> <laughs> you be trying to really get to it. Y'all know no. each other for how long? So what I think you should do is, like, asking a real conversational communication type of way. Yeah. Not in your feelings. Because I right. fucked Don't up sometimes. I fucked up sometimes. Real thoughts came out when I was drunk. Oh, you know shit. Now when you were drunk, too. Yeah. <laughs> I don't get drunk that often, but when I get drunk, the bitch gone. Be Look, crazy. That's that's my crown apple day. Oh yeah, I'm so glad we got through that. <laughs> yeah, my, my <laughs> relationship was gonna be over if I didn't get off crown apple, y'all. I'm gonna be honest. And <laughs> I didn't. We, I don't even have a drinking liquor. issue or nothing, but like that crown apple would do it to me. That dark, that cognac. <laughs> but um, so so like uh, how I. Cause you gotta get off your chest, and that's what I learned. Like, yeah. I'm not about to sit here and think this every time. When I could not say why we mad or whatever, but be like, "Yo, I just, I just want to know, yeah. like, did y'all ever talk?" Right. All right, but look, and you better fucking tell me the fuck. Now, what if she say, "Yeah, we used to talk, but it ain't work, so now we just friends." Are you gonna look at the person okay. different now? The friend. All respect. All respect. <laughs> All respect. And it's all respect because you know what? <laughs> oh fucking we because I ain't trying because I ain't trying. You about to say some crazy shit? You no, trying to no, clear like no, all respect? No, 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 respect. no. Because first of all, my woman, my wife ain't never do nothing to make yeah. me feel no type well, of way. Well, we can just speak so, hypothetically. We ain't even. Nah, but gotta, I mean, I'm oh, just okay, going to speak for okay. no, I'm, no. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm trying to keep. I'm trying to keep it clear. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. No, I'm just saying. Like, my girl does have a friend that she said liked her but she said no we could just be friends mm. right so now they are really close friends how you how you feel about that um i feel i feel like okay first of all outside of anybody this is how they all everybody i dated i'm gonna do the best i could do for you yeah either you gonna you gonna fucking love it and ain't nobody gonna compete with me or you gonna leave and i know i did the best i could do period so i don't never like 
I never went through your phone. I'm never searching because whatever yeah. happened in the dark will come to light. I'm trying to tell you. You know what I'm saying? Just in general. So, like, it's not, it's, yo, you with me. You know what I'm saying? But you, there do need to be some boundaries. <laughs> Because what's the boundaries? The boundaries? I mean, it just need to be some boundaries. Like we, <laughs> we need to figure out the boundaries. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but for real, like, like. Cause then is that doing too much? Like, all right, don't be acting different. Cause I told you we used to date when this was never the the case before. I told you. So what's different now? Now that you because, know? Yeah, of course. <laughs> like, but duh, I, I, ain't say, I ain't say they was dating and, and okay. just speaking in general or just, just they speaking, had a crush on me don't yeah, yeah, and, yeah. And, and and right now everything is in general like yeah, you yeah. should you should create boundaries mm -hmm. and you should respect your spouse and Facts. um knowing that situation you know um well how would you handle it man that's i don't i don't i don't know man <laughs> <laughs> like hey, no, it, just, it just get tricky it's so like I'm scratching my head <laughs> Maybe it'd be the alcohol part. You know, you get a little drunk, you'd be looking a little like, And that's oh, why you got to get all that communication out before. Yeah. Because it'll, it'll come out. And then, like, all right, this is what I would say <laughs> about about certain girls that I'll be dating. Like, they be kind of flirty, but, like, they never they never think they being flirty. And I'll be like, you being flirty. They're like, no, that's just my personality. That's that's a whole different situation. They but be like, flirty with different people. They just be like, I don't know. Some girls are too nice to where come off as flirty. I feel like Yo. sometimes I come off as flirty, but I'm just really being too fucking nice. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got my teeth done. Like, I'm going to smile <laughs> on your face. Like, what the fuck? I'm going to show my pearlies off. But, okay. like, I'm not mean I'm flirting with you, but I'll be feeling like some girls that I date, they be, like, really, like, flirty. You know what I'm saying? But then they be like, that's just me. I'm drunk. I don't I ain't even gonna know what lie. you're talking about. I don't like no flirty chick. Like, I yeah, like my chick a little, little gangster. Like, I like yeah. like I like my girl to look like she don't want to talk to nobody. Look at my, look at my it, girl. It, it gets she tough be, when you date be, somebody. She's a sweetheart, but she's not gonna be like, hi, That's hi, true. Hi. She don't be she kikin. Gonna, she's a, yeah, I think that come, with, that come with maturity, too. Like, you can't be all that kikin. Because everybody don't be having the same uh, what's the word? The same the same intentions as you so like you and somebody face kick in just on some friendship but they like they oh, think you it's saw excel girl yeah. laughing with me i heard her laughing at my joke about my <laughs> girl, knock knock joke like yo oh, she's like, <laughs> she like yo but that's where i would say it'd be like all right so but like i rather that security come in that too. is some insecure shit am yeah. i insecure bitch no, but Because I kind of no, don't even want to know. No. I don't ask because I don't want to know because then I don't want to start letting my is, mind. I'm an overthinker. See, and that's why you need to just have a real conversation because that's <sighs> that's where I got at, like, just learning throughout my relationships. Got all stuff, friends. So, I think... <laughs> <laughs> Damn, you fucked. Yo, she got all stuff, my, friends. Mom does, too. All her friends and stuff. And I be one... And, and, and they don't be like, saying that. They be like, Ashley about to come over. Bruh, they call him out of All right, reason. Ashley. Whole stuff come through the door. What up, G? And what like, up? I don't, I don't never be like... Ashley stronger than me and shit. I don't want to be tripping because, like... I don't, I don't want to be tripping because, like, y'all y'all years built in. Right. I'm new to the situation. I don't want to come in trying to seem like I'm regulating because yeah. it might come up as controlling. So it, it, it gets, like, you know. That's where that communication comes in. Yeah. Because I could say, I don't think like, I would want to know anything still, that though. me and my girl went through, it was like, okay. Because a lot of shit does come off in an argument when you ain't discuss it and it been on your chest. And like I said before, like, I don't like having shit on my chest. Yeah. I'd rather just get it out even if it sound because you know what we all have insecurities yeah. and we be trying to um act like we don't got no insecurities right, like, oh it's good I like no yeah one. but you be feeling some type of way like Definitely yo be we all be feeling some type of way sometimes get that shit off your chest but G. you know what's worse though when what's you worse? when you date a girl who bisexual <laughs> You know, I was going to say that. men friends. And we don't, we can't Ooh, trust you. you can't dudes. compete with no real dick. I'll be like, yo. Who can't? I remember, I, who okay, can't I remember I was dating a girl who was bi and she was like, I actually knew that they used to talk, but they was friends now. And he kept calling her bae. And it was, no. so, she like, that's just how he talk. I'm like, no, no bro. See, like, bae though. No, that's that. No, that's that fucking line, bro. I'm and, like, Beto, and that's where maturity come in because your woman needs to respect how shit. you feel too. And the thing is, like, there are certain things that, like, all right, let's say there's certain things that's od, yeah. and certain things that's like, okay, sh even though she might not agree with you, she can understand where you're coming from and work on it. Like, yeah. like, od is y'all out 
to five in the morning partying. All mm -hmm. right, like, like not answering the phone. Yeah, not texting back. you know what I'm saying. But Suspect. if you like, 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 if you don't want her out to five a.m. partying with him, she should understand that. But that don't mean she can't never have fun with. Him. You know what I'm saying? So That's it true. it it just come like Ooh. they gotta respect you too and not make you feel insecure about it. Yeah, man. But that we can't be OD. Thing, but that friend thing. That, that thing and and like you said tricky. with guys it's a whole other oh bro because guys don't really res i feel like a lot of dudes don't respect lesbian relationships and girl on girl relationship mm -hmm. they think it's just a phase and like they can still be saying what's oh, the phase like what the fuck <laughs> like what the this ain't no phase nigga like what are you talking about like but i just said yeah, one <laughs> the, right i was about to say that they ain't gonna get it you know what i'm saying but like yeah men that's a different type of like Whew. security that you gotta have because like girl when he called her bait and i was right there but he did say it like in a jokingly way, no. but like every joke got some truth to it. Don't, you know what I'm saying? No, don't don't say bae. Yeah, don't say bae. Like that's just that's Why? just doing, that's just doing a lot. Even if that's how you talk out of respect, don't do that. Let me ask you this. Have you ever um dated someone who had a friend and when y'all stopped talking, they started dating? And then you was looking at them like this whole fucking time I knew. Well, I haven't dated that many women, so. See, I need a, I need no. a thought up here with me. I need a fucking thought up here, I mean, here, I've just man, been like, I've been like in like four like, long term <laughs> relationships. You know what I'm saying? But um, I mean, I talk to girls in between. I said but I'm like, the only hole in the show. <laughs> uh, bitch, I even. Girl, you that, can't relate also, to. I need to bring a thought up here or something. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Am I gonna ruin our no homo show? Or is just two different perspectives? Because I'm always be the one that got the. I'm gonna pick us back up. <laughs> some whole so, shit we gotta so, talk about uh, i'm gonna talk about nah i haven't have you <laughs> um yeah yeah I, I definitely have uh dated somebody who i this is the this is a really crazy story because it was kind of like the girl said it was her friend but she actually was cheating on me with the girl at at the time why and, and why even me, be with somebody and had me hanging with the girl see that see that type of person you a shady ass bitch <laughs> I got yeah. mad. Yeah, man. I was dating this girl That's and like shady. she had this stud friend and I knew something was going on. Cause I'm like, bro, that ain't just your fucking friend. Like this girl like you. You know, just intuition. And That's then, the thing. Like, we be fighting with ourselves. Be, is this intuition or am I tripping? Exactly. Like, but it just be like, when it's intuition, I think it hits you a little bit. Like, nah, nah, nah. <laughs> don't sleep. Don't sleep. Don't sleep on it. Wake up, bitch. Come on now. Because be that's like, exactly what happened. I woke up and I went through her phone and I saw them kissing. We it had was a, a video. We had a fight. We had a time last <laughs> night. Boy, I beat the fuck out of that. Bro, we, bro. Because, look, you know, back in the day, I always told you a story on, on the show. No. Okay. So the girl, yeah. So you know, back in the day, when you put the iPhone on a laptop, you could at least get to the media, the photos, the videos. I don't know if you still can. It might be a hack. Try it. <laughs> you might be able to. But you ain't have to have no passcode or nothing. So uh. the red flag number one was I tried to go through her phone and her passcode was changed. Why your passcode changed? So yeah. I said, all right, bitch, I'm not getting your phone. You think I'm stupid? Connect to my laptop. And I oh, had to connect wow. to my fucking TV, you know, the HDMI cord. My TV was fucking huge, bro. That fucking picture came up on my big screen TV of her and that bitch kissing. And it wasn't no regular kiss, bitch. Her leg was up like this. <laughs> Not it she was like loved a so in love kiss, right? So I said, oh, okay. So I went to the back, right? And I'll never get this shot. I woke her up. I said, come around, I want you to see something. So she walked to the living room. She like this. She tried like she can't see. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, what's up I with this? Like, and, uh, like, we start hitting. That's how I got this mark right here. Because, like, I blacked out. I was choking the bitch. She bit my lip. It got really bad. That's the first time That's I got toxic. evicted. Now, that was Not yeah, the, first time, the first time I got evicted. And we didn't even call it quits after that. We dated for about three, four more years after that. That's that, and they ain't never get better. But some people like it. Just it's just really tricky. But like you did tell me about the lip. I ain't know it yeah, was all that. Yeah, that like I knew that they was talking, bro. I'm like, that's not just your friend. This bitch was cheating on and me just why with be, the girl. Maybe I'm just too grown now. Cause I was just like, why would you? I even mean, granted, we was it? young as hell. We was yeah. 19 and 20, but still, like. I almost got shot by that girl and everything. Like no. she put up to my crib with a gun. Like it was. Whew. That's. That Ooh. red flag. This show this is, is bringing. Dude, it's giving me anxiety. I think this kind of like therapy. This need, for real, because like I need therapy with a glass of champagne. Next yeah, time. we might have to. We might have to bring a little drinky drink on here, man. Mm. But the bottom line is, all right. Do you feel like 
people can genuinely just be friends or do you feel like it's always a they used to talk in the beginning let me let me say this I do feel like that, right? But as much as we want to worry about the studs, some of these femme bitches be liking them too. So don't be like, oh, that's a good don't point. Don't be the like, film friends yeah, be liking the films. Yeah, don't be like, you mm. know, um, oh, y'all just doing whatever. Did it? No, because I seen crazy shit go down with other like other people that be like, <laughs> you worried about the stud and she over there hunching on a, the other femme. But I do think I do think they there can be friends. Yeah. But you definitely have to draw boundaries out of respect for your relationship. Maybe a little extra than you would do if you wasn't in a relationship. Yeah. But the person you're with can't be like that. Can't be your friend no more. That can't be because of they a stud or not, unless they felt disrespected. That's fair. I'm gonna say this. I don't trust none of my my you girlfriend. Scratching your face. I don't trust none of my girlfriend friends. I just want them to be respectful. But I know at the end of the day, if she was single, you probably would try her because why wouldn't you try her? Unless you just want them kind of people that understand like you might ruin y'all friendship. Because I'm that kind of way too. Like I don't try certain people because I like you so much as a friend. I know that if we started dating, Ooh. and I would I would feel so wrong losing you as a friend. But one of my fem friends did kiss one of my exes. I'm gonna keep that as last For real? Yep. You remember that? One of your, fuck, one of your, Kiss oh, and, yes. And the whole time, it was always like some flirty shit. And I used to be like, y'all playing, right? And they'd be like, yeah, bitch, you know, we just playing. But no. See, I remember that. And they acting like, and then they be acting like you can't be mad because they both two family. Want to like, join no. us? No, I don't want to join y'all. What the fuck? I should have joined them. Say, no, nah, I'm playing. Yeah. This gay shit get weird, man. Especially with the films. That was a good point. Yeah, the film because friends. you got to watch out. Some Ooh. of them is sneaky. And some of these film and friends be studs at heart. They be so dominant. <laughs> I was like, bitch, you're not a film. You just got a wig on. You're a fucking stud, bro. So I'm going to end <laughs> on this. I, that's why it's very important to communicate yes. with your spouse and um, grow a strong relationship with your spouse because any of her friends can like her, but if she's solid with you, you ain't got shit to worry about. That's a great way to end it. Cause Ain't girl, it? I'm over here like, yeah, I don't trust none of you bitches. <laughs> nah, I, I'm just playing. I well, I think I think we wrap it up. Yeah, That's man. The no like, homo subscribe, show. comment. It's the no homo show. Too much shit, homo. Gay, 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 g